Greetings from Ibrox for this week's Rangers preview show. The transfer window is shut and autumn is just around the corner, which can mean only one thing. It's business time on the pitch. So much to look forward to in this episode, including... Well, so much to talk about uh, ahead of some massive, massive games for Rangers in the coming days. All in the week that several Rangers youngsters made their first team debuts as well. And the women's team found out who they'll be facing in their Champions League playoff match. So lots to get through and all in the company of Craig Moore. Welcome. Emma, nice to see you again. First time in the hot seat in this show. Welcome. Yeah, Welcome. The hot seat, I look forward to it. <laughs> Are you well? Are you keeping OK? Yeah, no, nah, good. Uh, you touched on the transfer window at the beginning, it, it's closed now, so a little bit of normality, Calm but it's down. preparing, I guess, for the next window. Yeah, exactly. Well, we mentioned it there, a huge week for Rangers coming up across all levels. Uh, lots and lots to look forward to, but let's start with the, the men's first team then, because the small matter of the first Old Firm game of the season coming up and away to Ajax in the Champions League. I mean, these are the weeks, these are the games you want to play in for Rangers, aren't they? Oh, it's brilliant. This is this is the time, you know, and it's a really competitive block coming up, you know, starting with the away to, to Celtic, which you know how tough it's going mm -hmm. to be. And for sure, the players would have been thinking about that match for for some time. Um, it's really important that you go and start well away from home mm -hmm. uh, because you know the way that Celtic start, they can start very, very quickly. But I believe if Rangers can go there and, and settle into the game, will definitely cause problems uh, and believe that we can go on and, and certainly win the match. Mm -hmm. But the start the start is crucial. You touch on Ajax, the start of the Champions League group. I mean, what a fantastic group. So you're right for the players, big games mm -hmm. coming uh, every week now, um, right up until till November, really. So it's fantastic. You know it's true for the fans, but is it the same for the players? Celtic, the first the first fixture you look for when the, when the lists are released in the summer? Yeah, you do. You do. You look at, you know, when that, that the fixture list comes out at the start, when is that first old mm. firm game? Where is it? Mm -hmm. um, you know, for us, I think, look, there's always pressure. There's no doubt about that. But I actually used to enjoy sometimes playing away from home as well because, you know, you're up against it. But more importantly, if you can go there and start well, mm -hmm. even maybe go and uh, get an early goal yourself to be able to quiet, quieten the crowd, um, that's always been enjoyable. And I think we've got the team that can go and do that as well. 